Jackson here at FreeGuitarMentor.com. And you know, Paul McCartney was really uh, the one noted amongst the two prominent Beatles songwriters for writing the upbeat major chord songs, and John was a little on the dark side as a writer. But uh, the song I have for you today is Things We Said Today. It shows a little bit of a different side of Paul. He wrote it while he was on his yacht uh, with his girlfriend at the time, Jane Asher, and uh, got to thinking about how difficult it was for them to blend their work out the relationship with the different careers going in different directions and uh, and this beautiful song with lots of nice minor chords in it things we said today came out of all that so here are the Beatles specifically Paul McCartney things we said today on freeguitarmentor.com okay well let's start out with the chords you'll need for this song and uh, then we'll get into the strumming pattern and put it all together. You need an A minor. You need an E minor. You need a C major. Jazz chord, you need um, a C sharp 9. If you don't know that one, we'll just talk about that for a sec here. Uh, your first finger is on the third fret of the fourth string. Your second finger is on the fourth fret of the fifth string. And then your third finger flattens out and plays the uh, fourth fret of the third and second strings. And that's, we're going to slide that down one because you also need the C9. So the C-sharp 9 and the C-9. You need an F major bar chord and a B-flat bar chord. You need an A major a D7 seven and an E seven. Okay, I know that's a lot of chords, so this this one's a little advanced as far as, as the number of chords you need to know for the song, but believe me it's worth it. Okay, let's talk about strumming. By the way, we're using our uh, J. Terser Cleopatra guitar today. Underrated. Um, first thing I want to tell you about is the little three-note piano hit uh, that John played on this song on the piano, and it was. Uh <laughs> We're going to accomplish that by, we're going to, we're going to um, down up down with an emphasis on that fifth string as we play the A minor chord. And I want to show you something here. My thumb is muting the E string so that it's not going to sound a note. What's going to sound is that open A. I'm in an A minor chord formation now. So it's like this. So it's da da da, down up down. So it's kind of a, a down, mute, up. The, the second one's kind of almost a half hit. You say you will love me if I have to go. You'll be thinking of me somehow.
when we get into the C chords, the jazz chords, um, what I want you to do is pick through the chord clearly, distinctly, so we hear each note. Someday when dreaming, wishing you weren't so far away, and then back into. to this that's just a full play through the whole chord when we get to that portion of the song the other strumming pattern comes in when we get to the uh, bridge part Four strokes down, picking down. Me, I'm just a lucky kind. Love to hear you say that love is love. And though we may be blind, love is here to stay. Okay. You know, those are all the strumming parts to the song, so I think we can put uh, <laughs> those many chords on the screen with some lyrics. And uh, if, you, if you've worked a little bit on this strumming, we can put this song together and have some fun with it. Wonderful, moody, great song. Going to be fun to play. Here we go. mentor but that should cover it um, you've got everything there this one is a little more complicated it's a few more chords 
Uh, some jazz stuff in there, some, some beautiful chords. But it's a great song, and uh, good luck with it. Have fun with it. We'll see you next time on Free Guitar Mentor. Dot com.